What's up guys, Garage Max out here. Uh, today I'm gonna do a video on the request of Harris Herman. I uh, did a shout out in a different video regarding uh, the E7240 laptop series that I've got uh, a few videos on now actually. Uh, and the question or, or the request was to install an M SATA solid state drive into the WAN port of this laptop and do a speed test, see if it's the same uh, speed as the other port. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do today. I actually haven't tried it yet. We're gonna check it out, see if it works. I've read a couple of reports online of people getting this to work uh, with really good results. So I've got a spare 256 gig drive here. Uh, this is actually the last E7240 that I have of the 18 that I got uh, just a few weeks ago. I'll put a link so that you guys can check out that other video. Uh, but enough talking, let me go ahead and open this thing up. We're gonna try and see uh, how this thing fits in here and give it a try. Okay, so it actually booted with the right boot priority. I'm really happy with that. So we're gonna see, I have a crystal disk info here to see if it's recognized properly. And this is a good sign. So this is the primary drive here. And this is the one we just installed. And it's showing SATA 600 for both of them, which is really, really good. So let's go ahead and do a speed test and see what the speed difference is between the two. And I'll go ahead and I'll test first on the one that's installed in the normal M SATA port. Okay guys, so here's the speeds for the first run on the on the primary drive. Go ahead and snip this. <clears throat> and then we'll go ahead and run it on the one in the WAN slot. Okay guys, so I'm pretty happy uh, and surprised with these results. I mean, essentially what this is saying is uh, they run at the same speeds. Uh, the drives themselves have slight differences just because of the, the write count on them. So this one's got 7,600 gigs written and this one's 8,000, but uh, the, it looks like they are physically the same in terms of uh, throughput availability. So really good news. Uh, if you've got a Dell laptop and it's got one of these uh, WAN ports on it, um, most likely you'll be able to throw an M SATA drive in there and, and double up on storage for, for very inexpensive without having to reinstall Windows. So hope this helps somebody and thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and ring the bell. I'll see you guys next time.